You just sign on? You're from Esperanza. I fell. Tattoos and colorful hair. No, no. I'll keep an eye out. Gracias. I'm worried something terrible has happened. My true Yaras. When you close your eyes and you hear the word What is that red smoke? Got to be careful here.
think I'm going to be sick. Castillo, you fucking monster. I need more pigs. What the fuck are they doing to these poor people? I need more pigs. came from in there. I've got a bad feeling about this place. All of this bullshit about treating cancer. Well, this should be enough to convince Lorenzo. El Tigre, I've got the pics. You won't believe what they're doing to our people. It's horrific. Oh, I believe it. But it's Lorenzo who needs convincing. And what about Gabriela? I don't know what to tell you. She's gone. Uh, I had a feeling. Okay. Get those photos back to camp. It's time for Lorenzo to wake up.
On Ron, I'm at a church in. Where am I? The Savannah. Basilica de la Virgen. That building should be celebrating his birthday. He's a hundred years old. I'm not seeing a party here. Castillo stopped the renovations. A couple of corrupt priests and well, it's shut down. Oh, shit. I was baptized there. A lot of creepy, junky priests came through that place. Come mierdas. Hey, que bola. Repinga. We were just kids, El Tigre. <laughs> <laughs> Lorenzo. I took pictures of that place Honron was talking about. You swipe to the left. They look free to you. Yeah. This is what Libertà and La Morale are fighting. You can hate us, but at least we're doing something about it. No one deserves this, Lorenzo. This is happening all over Yara. You just can't see it from so high up this mountain. I can't look at this anymore. I didn't vote for Castillo. The war is over. So that was a waste. That's the end. You shoot the tree.
unidentified pilot, land your craft immediately. This is your last and only warning. What? Getting close, I think. So you know, Helena's the big boss. I'm team captain, and you won't be able to miss Gilberto. Why? Who's Gilberto? Only the most fabulous spy in Guadalajara. You can't even fart in LA without Gilberto's network hearing about it. Spies and hackers. La moral sounds like the real deal. You don't fuck around. And if you've never been to Concepcion before, the place has got a curfew. When the sun goes down, soldados come. Thanks for the heads up. Coño, I got a helicopter on my ass. Call me when you get there. On run. I'm at Concepcion. How do I find La Moral? I'll send you a pic. Show no one. What are you sending me? It will help you find the door. Don't forget the password and remember. Curfew. Attention inhabitants of Concepcion. This is a reminder that curfew will be in effect tonight. It is strongly urged that you respect this safety measure established by your government. A lovely yacht, no? Muerto el perro, se acabó la rabia. Welcome to El Agujero. Try anything and I'll cut your head off and use it as a football. Nice to meet you too. My name's Danny. Alfredo. Down the stairs.
need six volunteers. I'll talk to my people, honey. Big Jorge and Anna's gangs are probably on the ship. Your Yelena? Mierda! Danny, right? Where's my medicine? You mean Libertas meds? I gave them to the legends. No. You handed it to some retirees shitting their diapers on top of a mountain. What could you possibly want from them? We need more than bullets and guerillas to take down Castillo. Like it or not, Yaranos love the legends. Clara Garcia loves her politics. Good luck getting those abuelos off their asses. We could use La Moral's help. You know why Clara never told you about us? Because to her, we're just a bunch of kids playing with guns. She loves to talk about the future. But it's her future, not ours. Clara's just a Castillo who lost his dick. So you have a better plan for Yara? Bullets first, politics later. You said you needed volunteers. Admiral Benitez got the jump on us a couple of hours ago. She's holding my people hostage on a cargo ship. I'll go. Alone? I don't get it. Consider us even for the meds. Save my people and I'll think about it. Mm -hmm. For real? Libertad? No shit. You saving our people, right? That's the plan. I know a farmer with a helicopter who can fly you out to the ship. Follow me. Take old Irasol. Be nice to him. Come on. That's it. You're okay. <laughs> You're with Libertad? I am. I think it would be great if we joined forces. Yeah? We've been fighting and we've been winning. But Admiral Benitez will always have more than we do. We kill one soldado today. Tomorrow they get replaced with three more. And when La Moral people die, there's no one replacing them? Not yet. Where are you going? So, yeah. Nadie. On top of that, the farmers and the people just trying to survive don't want to fight. We need fresh blood. Real fighters. What about getting the legends to join? We tried. None of those abuelos want to fight. I heard a lot of them even support Castillo. You heard wrong. Well, I don't see any abuelos fighting now. I'm working on it. So, how do these farmers get a helicopter? They built it from the parts of ones we shot down. Inga. These farmers are 100% on our side. The other farmers are not? Some are. Some are with Castillo. You think we can get them on our side? We're gonna need them. Only when we're going to liberate El Este. Maybe when... What's are going, going on? going to save those people? Yelena called. Do you want to lift to that boat? Let's do this. Get in. Time's wasting. <laughs> Open, let's fly. My name's Calixto. Danny! I'm going to be careful and stay low. I'll get you as close as I can. Where did you learn how to fly? I did my basic service as a pilot a couple of years ago. I got kicked out for calling the captain a come mierda. <laughs> I was kicked out of the ground forces. Turns out drill sergeants don't like getting punched in the throat. Good to know. I never seen you before. When did you join La Moral? <laughs> Wait. I was told you were with La Moral. I'm doing this rescue as a favor. I'm with Libertad. What can you tell me about La Moral? Know that village? They call it Maldito. That the real name? Yeah. Some Spaniard named it back in 1490, whatever. Couple of months ago, Admiral Benitez decided to make it illegal to go to the water and fish. The people protested. Benitez executed half the town. So what does La Moral do? They tracked and killed every last soldado who did the executing. And I'm not talking about guerrilla ambush jungle shit. I'm talking about following them to their homes and slitting their throats while their families asleep. 
assassin shit. These kids are smart, coordinated, and cold-blooded. Sounds like it. That shop pass. We keep tabs on military convoys passing through there and report them to La Morale. Seems like they run a tight operation. These kids are on the ball. Yelena is more organized than the military. La Morale's got our back. When Admiral Panita started getting rough with our families, La Morale got rough back. Killed any soldado who dared to step foot on our lands. Pretty soon, they stopped coming. That's the ship. I can't get you any closer. This is great. Gracias, mi amigo. Good luck saving those people. some of our fighters in a container over the wall. Save them! Admiral Benitez, to the fake Yaran terroristas, I have you right where I want you. At this very minute, military forces are heading to your position. I recommend laying down your weapons and taking one last look at a nation that does not want you. Instead of peacefully serving Yara as outcasts, you will die. Right here. Right now.
This is Admiral Benitez. To the fake Yaran terroristas, I have you right where I want you. At this very minute, military forces are heading to your position. I recommend laying down your weapons and taking one last look at a nation that does not want you. Instead of peacefully serving Yara as outcasts, you will die. Right here. Right now. Your people are safe. I heard. We even for the supplies? Fuck yeah. Need me for anything else? Come back to El Aguero. She is getting real. We need to rally our 
your people and talk next steps. Dale. Oh no. I feel like bad shit's gone down here. Soy quien sale y lo reparte por la calle Soy la voz de barrio de donde crecí Dice tu padre de su tupa que tiene sus ojos sobre mí Clara, I've met La Moral. Why didn't you send me to them first? La Moral? Last I heard they were a small group always on the edge of falling apart. They're doing more fighting than the legends. Okay, but watch your step. La Moral has a bad rep, and I don't want Libertad's name to be dragged down with him. I'll keep my eyes open. I heard you kick Benitez's ass, Daddy. What's happening? Meeting on the mound. Some of our friends want to quit early. Okay, listen up. This isn't worth killing for. Sure as hell isn't worth dying for. We're young. We should be out there drinking and fucking and... Skip in school. Woo! Our parents and grandparents already stole our future. Why should we give a shit? That's what I used to think. And then one day, Admiral Benitez walked into my classroom with a gun. She called on your name, you came to the front. One by one. Alvarez! Bermudez, Carrillo. The Admiral read their crimes. Protesting, handing out pamphlets, liking a Clara Garcia post. Fernandez, Jimenez, Peña. I learned a lesson on my last day at school. You can either be on the right side of history or the wrong side of Castillo's guns. Wise words, young Guerrilla. La Moral taking new members? Depends. What? Is there an age limit? I will plead for La Moral. If you take me. Welcome to the war, viejo. <laughs> So how do we take out the Admiral? Push-ups are the first step to victory. The Grand Hotel, Danny. That's the key. I got a convoy I like to make friends with. No. 
We need Carlito. Push-ups never lie. You just cut your hand open. You sure doing push-ups was such a good idea? What can I say? Your little speech puffed me up. Hey, the part where you put the gun to your head and pull the trigger? I loved it! <laughs> Vanny needs to take care of our little problem at the hotel. Well, why didn't you say so? All we need is Don't fuck with the seat is just how I like it.
Lamboros here, no? Like a fucking fat.